be wrapped around your arms instead of being lonely. We could be gazing at the stars. Are you okay? Feels just like I wandered off. Uh, sorry, I was rushing around a corner. Um, I didn't mean to fall or anything. I. I was just in a corner and I didn't see a puddle and I guess I hurried around it too quickly and I s lost my footing or something. I slow down. I'll ask you again. Are you okay? Uh, yeah, I I'm okay. Thanks to you. I'm glad. You need to be more careful. Good thing I was here. Another time, another place, I just Yeah. Mm -hmm. It could have been you. Oh my gosh, I saw what happened. Are you okay? Sometimes I see around clots. It should have been you. Earth to Angel, are you okay? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Who was that guy? I don't know, but he seemed familiar. And why does that answer make sense? Yes, Mr. Levi? Corresponding angles. Huh? Uh, it's him. Correct, since they lie on the same side of the transversal and corresponding positions, aka their corresponding angles, the answer is correct. Okay, is he still there? God, so weird. Hiding around a corner. Okay, you got this. Calm down. There's nothing to be worried about. Whew. I'm just gonna go up and introduce yourself. He doesn't even know your name. It's makes sense. He saved your life and everything. Okay. Uh, uh, hey. Uh, hey. You're the class from earlier, right? Angel. Uh. My name's Angel. Oh, uh, sorry. Angel. I'm... Angel Atwood, please head to the principal's office. I repeat, Angel Atwood, please head to the principal's office. I'll see you around, sorry. Oh god. The principal's office. Why am I being called up here on my first day of school? Oh god. Principal Gray, I Mom? Sweetie! Joy texted me and told me everything. Are you okay? If not, we can sue the school and... No, Mom. <laughs> Don't sue the school, please and thank you. I'm okay. There's no need to worry. I'm fine. Okay. Uh, why am I here? And why is she here? Your mother wanted to make sure you were okay. Her threats to the school weren't the most pleasant, but we understand where she's coming from. We'll be talking with the janitor and making sure he puts caution signs down from here on out. That's probably best. <sighs> Do you need to come home? No, I I'm fine, Mom. There's nothing to worry about. I'm great. Someone call me. I'm safe and sound. Okay, I just wanted to make sure, sweetheart. Call me if you need anything. Will do, Mom. This is such a nice spot. It's beautiful out here. I'm surprised more people don't know about it. I know, right? Charlie always comes here. Loser has no friends. Uh, hey! <laughs> Actually, Cassidy, you just lied to my face because he does have friends. Me! Really? I mean, we're hanging out, aren't we? I feel like that makes us friends. Um, I mean, if you want to be my friend, then obviously, I'd be more than happy to be you guys' friends. I told you she was nice. <laughs> Speaking of nice, I texted my friend Joy, she's a sweetheart by the way, um, 
I texted my friend Joy that um, we were out here. She's been my friend since childhood. She actually might know your guys' parents now that I think about it because your guys' parents met my parents in high school and so did her parents. So I mean, who knows? They might actually be friends. I might go look for her just in case. <gasps> Joy! There you are! Speak of the devil! <laughs> Sorry. Hey guys, I'm Joy. Sup, I'm Cassidy and this is Charlie. He's my way less charming but older brother. Nice to meet you, Joy. I, I like your flower in your hair. <laughs> Thanks. So, um, can I join you guys? Uh, yeah, totally. Sit down. in the road? I mean, we have the deer crossing signs, but my god, just a full-grown horse? Okay, buddy, I'm gonna leave you alone. I'm assuming you escaped from a nearby farm. Dude, be careful. These roads are rowdy. They're very rowdy. Okay, let's park our bike. There we go. Got all my stuff on me, so... Okay. It's weird to think that my first day of high school is already basically done. All I do is homework. <sighs> wow. How time has flown. It's crazy. <gasps> Dad! Hey! So, how'd your first day of school go, little lady? It went great, spectacular, passed with flying colors. And for the whole falling over the rail part? I'm not dead, am I? Fair enough, kid. Me any friends? Uh, funny you ask. Um, so, Uncle Lucas is one of my teachers, actually. Apparently him and Aunt Belle moved here because he got a job offer at the school. And so that means that their children are at my school. And I've actually gotten really close to Cassidy and kind of too close to Charlie a little bit. Lucas? Oh, that's awesome. We should plan a dinner soon. I can make my famous homemade chicken fried steak. How come you only make your homemade good food when I am, when, when, when other people are over instead of just for me? What if I just want the homemade food, Dad? Hey, don't give me attitude, little lady. I'm making homemade fish and chips tonight in celebration of your first day. <gasps> Ooh, I love filming fish, I can't speak. I love homemade fish and chips, especially yours. Okay, and try to keep it low-key about Lucas and Belle moving here. Your mom's gonna freak out. Low-key, you got it. You don't gotta worry about me, Dad. Finger guns, yeah. Hey, Mom! <laughs>